how you're doing it you're gonna done it so I'm just headed to a park to work out it's the only day I really have to leave the house to find a pull-up bar as part of the monkey strength program links are down below of course if you share the, the book you get 10% off on Facebook I tell you there's nothing like that morning fresh crisp freezing air to burn your air lungs Do we have air lungs so I figured today we'd talk about the dangers of getting shredded and why it's like a Illuminati mind trap. They want you to be shredded to keep you weak and sick. Is that a castle? You can't see it. It's castling so hard right now. So I just want to warn you against the trend of getting shredded. Oh, I'm 8% body fat. You're an 8% loser. You're all you ever had to be You're all you ever had to be Take control of your life, you can't be mad at me I don't know who started the modern day fitness trend If it was Arnold Schwarzenheimer Or his brother, Jimmy Schwarzenheimer But all you see in any advertisement, even in Thailand I'm seeing shredded women modeling their t-shirts and underwear I'm like, really, y'all got a six pack? How are you going to get pregnant in there with a six-pack? Pregnant six-pack, bitch. There's nothing healthy about being that low body percentage. Fat percentage. You have a low percentage of body. You suck. The benefits of having body fat are enormous and numerous. The hormone production. Having body fat, you just produce whatever hormone you need on the spot. Toxin protection. If you have some body fat, no matter what happens to you, you eat some gluten, just boom, absorbed into your fat, protect it. Also, it's easier to fast when you're a little fat. I'm noticing it. I went the whole day, I had one meal yesterday, just the one meal, and I was fine all day because I got some more body fat. If you look into the world of people that are low body fat percentage, it's usually people in competitions for bodybuilding or athletes, UFC weight cutters, they're all miserable. At some point, you get miserable. The lower body fat you have, the more miserable you are. I just feel happier and happier the fatter I get to a point. People seem to misunderstand me thinking, I want you obese. I'm not talking about getting so fat where you're just, you're hindered in your daily life. You're squeezing through doors awkwardly, folding your belly in. All right, we made it. Sir, can you squeeze my butt in the door? I got the belly, you get the butt. Oh no. <laughs> I really think it's an agenda to keep us sick. It's everywhere. All you see is men shredded, women shredded, everybody's shredded, and it's like the least healthy state you can be in. It's like you can't even survive. What if, what if all your power goes out, you run out of food, grocery store shut down for a week? The skinny people are dead first. It's almost like there's a conspiracy to keep us weak suppressed, easy to control, who's doing it? Is it our reptilian overlord ancestors? Why are they doing that? You're my pet alligator, bitch. That's why I kind of think the vegan diet could be a ploy to keep us a little weak, just because I felt a little weaker as a vegan. In the mind as well, less confident. It's like, yeah, okay. Just do it, whatever. Veganism could be being pushed on us by the medical industry in order to sell supplements instead of medication. They wised up, people are like, okay, they're not taking medication, they realize they can cure themselves, we gotta sell something. So it's B12, D3, DHA, carnosine. So work out just for the exhilaration. Just don't you feel so much better after you've exercised? Get the blood pumping. It's just like getting stronger feels good. The mirror image of your body will look fine. Just don't put so much pressure on yourself to get down to body fat percentages lower than a snake. Sure, it looks kind of cool. The shredded physique, the abs popping out. My face is numb. I can't speak anymore. Back in the day, wasn't ain't nobody trying to get shredded. That was like, you think Marilyn Monroe was trying to just slim down for that eight pack? I don't think she was. She was all up in those eggs and butter. I gotta admit something here. 
I never used to find fat girls attractive because they didn't seem healthy. It just felt like they had no discipline and they were sickly physically. So I was like, yeah, that's not very attractive. But now, I saw this Thai girl. I just remember she stuck out in my mind. She wasn't like obese, but she was just robust. She's sitting there on her scooter and her legs, like she had tight skin. It wasn't like lumpy cellulite. She just looked healthy, robust and healthy. So there's something to that. Just having some meat on your bones. Don't be a skinny meatless bone boy. Some women are so worried about getting fat, they're trying to get as skinny as possible. And sometimes you can take that just too far. Your face gets sucked in and then you're just, you're not producing the hormones, you're, you lose your period. I lost my period three years ago. Never got it back. So I'm working on that. I'll get it back. So let's stop the shredded madness. Let's just build happy, healthy bodies that can survive a winter. No more. Hashtag shred yourself. What? I was at shutter speed 200. If I looked jittery, like I was jitterbugging all over the place. That's why. From a camera conspiracy network followers. Go subscribe to Kim. You're not gonna do it. So that's my message. Let's boycott the shredded mentality. Just get a little pudgy. Get a little pudge factor in your life. And I think we're done. What do you think of that? Fat healthy? Not too fat though, but kind of fat. Thank you so much for watching the video today. Consider giving it a thumbs up if you liked it. Thumbs down. If you called a squirrel peanut breath and then he peed on you, gotta suck karma for you just be nice to your fellow human beings they'll be nice to you we create this world we create the society be nice to people and they will love you we're done thanks for buying a monkey strike book get stronger not shredded dot com i'm gonna leave subscribe for more videos we'll see you Monkey gains are earned, they're never just given to you.